Okay, ideas 111 says, I purchased your SEO power show and I have some questions as to the best structure. My client has several web properties that would be best if they would be branded as one entity using her name. The business recently changed structure with the new business name being her name. So this works well. Several of these sites are old and need to be replaced with better siloed sites. Is it effective to build the SEO power shield and include these old properties, siloing the information in the shield and then add information from the new site as it is completed? Uh, I don't know. This is a, I almost need a diagram for this. <laughs> I'm trying to visualize what you're telling me in your head, but, or uh, I'm trying to visualize in my head what you're telling me and I'm, I'm having difficulty. Um, also, I need to promote one of their new sites immediately as they are opening several other locations just for IV therapy and nutrition. Would this get a separate SEO shield or just a separate syndication network? Thank you. Marco, this seems like a bit of a complicated question. And uh, without all the details, I don't know if I could give a proper answer. Are, were you able it, to interpret it's, this? No, well? it's, it, it's not something that, I'm, that would be answered here. This is requiring just a, a lot of what I would consider consultation time. It's not something that we do on hump day. We don't answer anything this intricate because this requires just a whole lot of different things. And then we, we have to go look at it and see wh which one would be the best way to answer it, right? Yeah. Like how, how would we approach this? This requires, it's not something that I can answer cold. Yeah. Yeah, it's difficult. I mean, just from rereading it while you were talking, I mean, if just uh, on, a, on a very high level, if there's multiple websites that should be brought under one brand, then I would almost say, why not create one website under that, you know, parent or master brand, and then set up silos on that website, and then, you know, basically, um, import the content from the existing individual sites into the new site and then do redirects from the old sites that to me it, it makes a mess if you've got a bunch of different websites out there that were separate websites but now you want to bring them all under one entity if they're related and it makes sense then absolutely you can but what i would suggest is housing them all under one domain right and you could you could just you repurpose the old con just so you set up proper silo structure on the, the new branded domain uh, even if it's her name or whatever, it doesn't matter. Uh, and then you would set up silos, which would have been each of the individual sites. You bring that content in. It could be literally copy paste to bring that content in. And then you would set up redirects from the old domains to the new section, you know, the corresponding pages on the site, that kind of stuff. So that you're pushing all of that relevancy to that one domain, that one entity. Uh, but then there's a lot of schema stuff that could be done there that would really need to be done to, um, combine all that into one entity. Uh, also the, the, the SEO or excuse me, the SEO shield that could all be mirrored. Once that original website, the main entity, main branded entity website would be built out correctly and formatted correctly. Like all of that could be duplicated or mirrored into the SEO shield. But again, without knowing like all the different pieces and stuff, like does it make sense to mix them all under one entity or not? And only you can answer that. Um, so I agree with Marco. This is one of those questions that more context is needed and probably gonna need more, um, you know, more cons uh, consultation from somebody. So that would be like a great question for the Semantic Mastery Mastermind. Um, and I don't know if you guys in Heavy Hitter are doing like audits and stuff, but that would be a really good question for the mastermind. So, sorry, I couldn't give you a better answer for that. No, th this is something, I mean, we've done it. We, we did it for, for Pete Hogg and, and in my Ask Marco Anything webinars. I'll even, I'll even go into that, right? But, but not here, because this requires me actually going and looking at everything and seeing how I would put it together for the question that he's asking. Is that something that you can just fly out off the cuff on and say, oh, yeah, yeah, do this and this and this? Yeah. Because if I change, like the, 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 like the name changed it. And so now what do we do? What do we do with the old property? I have to look at them. How much value is there in them? And how much change? There's just so much. I can't answer it. Yeah, I agree. This, it's it's a, a complicated question with very little information, uh, which I know it'd be hard to, honestly, if you posted a great big wall of text trying to explain all this stuff, we wouldn't even cover it anyways. So um, again, that's more of a, one of our paid groups. Uh, we try, I tried, I tried to give you some somewhat of an answer, but I know that probably didn't suffice. And for that, I'm sorry. 